opportunity to showcase our musical ensembles in another country. We're doing concerts in um, Shanghai, uh, Xi'an, and Beijing, which is where we are right now. We definitely wanted to bring both the chamber choir and the orchestra. But when we started to think about all the different ensembles that we offer at Denison and the experiences that we give the students, we thought, hey, why not bring the swing jazz group and the bluegrass group, as well as Singer's Theater Workshop just so that they can sort of see what's popular and what's now starting to be studied in the academy. Make me confused, mock me with praise, let me be used, very my days. Oh, I think it's great for students like us when we're still young to get this experience so we can grow from this as students and pass on that knowledge and, and, and enhance our cultural education as well as our musical and academic education. program throughout our trip to China here is focusing on American music, uh, which includes music composed by our Denison composers He Kyung Lee and Ching Chu Hu. And of course we're doing jazz, which is American music, and bluegrass, which is really American roots music. And uh, it's a great kickoff to our new bluegrass program. China, people don't normally see a lot of foreign groups, and uh, so being able to hear some American traditional music, it's kind of a refreshing for them. It's a good way of doing it so we can introduce our part, the American part of culture. I think Xi'an has been my favorite city so far. The city of Xi'an and the sponsors of a music festival for which we were the kickoff group flew us into Xi'an and gave us the most amazing opening ceremonies possible. We were seated inside the southern wall of Xi'an where they treated us to various examples of traditional music and martial arts and a whole opening ceremony that would be typical of an emperor welcoming heads of states. The response to all the music, from Singer's Theater through the bluegrass, through the large ensembles with the choir and the orchestra, has just been really tremendous. People just love it. And um, I just think it helps to validate what we're doing musically at Denison. People are just really great to us. Guys, we're treated like rock stars.
concert hall that we're at today is actually the China Conservatory of Music. And uh, their sister company is actually Juilliard. So it's fantastic to see that we're sharing music with a sister company with Juilliard. It says a lot about how far along Denison's mu music program has come uh, just in the last 10 or 15 years. China is just a such a fascinating country, and where is where I'm from. I'm just eager to show the students like my roots, you know, where I am coming from. Hopefully, they will have will have more connections between the faculties and the uh, students. It is an amazing trip, and we're coming to some of the world's oldest cities, and it's just something that can't be replaced. Two out of five. <laughs> The strengths of Denison don't remain in Granville or Ohio or even the United States, but our talents and our interests bring us all the way around the world. Everywhere we go, we tell them that we are a liberal arts institution. We're not a music conservatory, and then they hear the music that we're making. It's yet another way that we can show our strengths. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes.